What's up, RCHS? I'm Schrader. And I'm Cameron. And this edition of Lions Live starts right now. Attention Key Club members, this is a reminder that we will have a meeting during SRTB in the lecture hall. We will have a speaker and we'll be making mats for the homeless out of plastic bags. Please make plans to attend. Today's lunch is chicken nuggets, mac and cheese, green beans, cauliflower with fruit, and as always, milk. Here's Alan Bushy with a live weather update. Thanks guys, now on to weather. It's currently 50 out with a high of 66 and a low of 41. It feels like 46 out, it's pretty cold out. Now back to the desk. The Lady Lions tennis team fell to an experienced water squad with a score of 0 to 5. It was a great learning experience that the team plans to build upon in the upcoming weeks. The team's record now is 1 and 1. The Rushville boys track and field team traveled to Greensburg on Saturday morning to compete in the annual Crossbones Relays. Due to rainy condition, the field events and the hurdles were canceled, but the rest of the running relays were held and the athletes had a memorable meet racing in the rain. Team scores were not kept, but the Lions competed very well against runners from Columbus North, Greensburg, Greenfield Central, Franklin County, and Madison. The 4x800 team of Keith Bacon, Caleb Crodel, Adam Bowsman, and Charlie Starrett finished in fourth place with a season best time of 9.06. The team of Shepherd Cup, Ryan Schindler, Heath Berda, and Sam Starrett finished ninth. The 4x100 team of Harper Miller, Alec Evans, Colton Griffith, and Jake Vance came in second with time of 47.40. The 4x200 team of Jaden Rusa, Ashton Hammond, Josiah Hay, and Carter Tagg finished third overall with the time of 143.7. The 4x400 team of Bacon, Hay, Evans, and Tagg came in third with a season best time of 349.7. The Lady Lions also competed in the... Uh, Cross Bounds Relay, the 4x800 team of Cindy Tush, Olivia Weir, Isabel Westfall, and Savannah Westfall finished in fourth place with a season best of 11-4. The 4x200 team of Cindy Tush, Lexi Morris, Cassie Tells, and Lily Crodel finished third overall with a time of 2.08. The Sprint Medley Relay team of Tellus Morris, India Burnett, and Isabella Westfall finished fifth with a time of 2.16. Both track and field teams will be in action tomorrow at Southport against Southport, Conjola, and New Palace. The Lions golf team got their season off to a good start, edging out the North Decatur Chargers 173 to 174. The Lions are 1-0 on the season and will next be in action tomorrow at home against Knightstown, Eastern Hancock, and Newcastle with a 4:30 start. The JV softball team faced Shenandoah on Friday night. An early lead helped Profell Rushville Lady Lions JV to a 16-6 victory. Over for Shenandoah, Asher went 4-4 four for four at the plate to lead Rushville Lady Lions JV in hits. Asher also led the team and offensively with four putouts for the Lady Lions. Rushville Lady Lions JV scored six runs in the second inning. Rushville Lady Lions JV offense in the inning was led by Asher, Kylie Herbert, Strain, Marsh, and Kyle Parsley. Or Kylie Parsley. All driving in runs in the inning. Kylie Gray got the win for the Rushville Lady Lions JV. The freshman allowed five hits and six runs over five innings, striking out three and walking one. Now on to sports action. For sports action tonight, the softball team will travel to Connorsville for a game of 5.30. The baseball team will also be in action tonight as they face against Greensburg at home with a start time of 5.30. The Lady Lions tennis team will be, on that, will be in action tonight as well as they travel to Newcastle for a game at 4.30. That's it for me, now back to the desk. Have a great day, RCHS.